we take a look at the tail of the tape for this one. Jared Rochalt, ranked number two. Kyle Alencar out of Brazil, his opponent. Rochalt, 6'2", 256.8. And almost an identical reach between the two fighters. Alencar at 38 years of age. We set it inside the cage and Jeff Securo. So we are set to go. This one's scheduled for three rounds in the heavyweight division. Glad to be joined by MMA legend, New York resident, Henzinho Gracie. Oh, yeah. Pleasure to be here with you guys Good again. Good to have you with us, brother. It's my so pleasure. And it's great to see Fight. a packed house, man. It's unbelievable. Sold out here in the theater at Madison Square Garden. Alan Carr comes out with a flying knee for the big man. All right, Henzo, you know the big fellas. You just saw your man, David Branch, defend his title. It was an impressive performance by beautiful, DB. Beautiful, beautiful fight. He's always he's always putting wow. up a show, you know. That was, and his opponent was extremely tough. Yep. And I didn't know it, but the guy who actually trains his opponent was one of my students when I moved to United States. In oh, really? Yes, oh, yes. What do you know about Kayo? I mean, his kicks look great. I, I can say that already, but do you have more information about him? I actually don't. It's the first time that I see him. I know that he belongs to a very strong camp. This guy's from Manaus, a very tough. You know, it's uh, one of the main uh, uh, places in Brazil to make unbelievable fighters. Like, Jacaré is one of them. Oh, wow. Kyle Alexander, Alan Carter oh. going 6'4", 250 out of Natal, Rio Grande, Brazil. And he is on the prowl right now, going up against Jared Rochalt, who's making his World Series of Fighting debut. And these certainly are the heavyweights. Both big men, but throwing some heavy oh, lumber. He's and Rochalt hard. making two big wow. shots as Alan Carr is coming back now with that big looping right. He's got it. It almost looks like he's picking him up. Oh, yeah. yeah. He's down. Five and two over. shots. That's it. That Five is it. Over. As Alan Carr ends it for Rochalt. The three-time All-American from Oklahoma State just unable to answer the striking of Alan Carr. You Throwing might want to bones. get him into the Henzo Gracie gym because that big man can strike. Yeah, and he was very comfortable. I don't know if you realize by the end, he wasn't fearing at all his counters. He went right into the distance and started landing those what we call haymakers or throwing those bricks over the, his opponent's guard. Beautiful work. And you can see that he can move, look. He has some good suit, yes. He's a very athletic big guy, you know? Here comes the end one more time. Rochal in, having problems right here already. And then it's a combination. Two hammer fists, and it's ended. Quick finish in the heavyweight division. We'll be back with the official word when we return after this. WSOF NYC live on NBCSN back inside the theater at Madison Square Garden at the conclusion of one round, not even one round of heavyweight fighting between Jared Rochalt and Kyle Allencar, and the fight is stopped early as we set it inside the cage. The official decision here is Jazz Securo. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is over at one minute and 17 seconds of round number one. Your winner by knockout, Kyle. With Henzo Gracie and Boss Root, and let's take a look at the end of this fight. What did she say? Love your dad, love your mom, love my kids, love my nephews, the whole family. A big kiss on everyone. That's why we bring Henzo in at the right time. <laughs> Henzo, let's take a look at this. This is obviously something that's happened already. He's, Jared's in trouble already. Yeah, he was, he was able to land some very hard shots right before that. So on, on, that, on that moment, Jared is already trying to survive. 